When a car is your dream, well, here's a basic tutorial on how to do a basic wiring of an orange circuit. It's so basic, as in there, there's not even a relay in this circuit. And then after this, we're going to draw a diagram. So, let's begin. Alright guys, first of all, let's look at the horn. Well, as you can see here, this one has two. As you can see here, this one has two tabs. One is positive, one is negative. That's how this works. So, you have a coil in here. The positive comes in, goes around the coil to make the sound, and it goes back out to ground. That's how this works. That's how this works. Okay? That's how that works. So, that's all right. Here, we got a little talent switch. So here you, again you have the two tabs, one coming in from pad battery positive and the next one going out to your, to your, um, let's say your load or your circuit. Take into consideration this could be a light, a light, a lamp or a light bulb, it could be a blower motor. Use this as an example for anything you want, this could be anything you want. But just remember, this is just a basic tutorial. I'll, I'll, I'll throw in a wiring with a relay eventually. Over here now we have the fuse. You're supposed to see this in the other video. Circuit protector. So we need this. So And then you have wires. And then you got 12 volt battery. 12 volt battery. Negative positive. So wire cutter and test light test light circuit in the next video we're gonna do some diagnostic work on it with the three different tools I showed you in the last video the multimeter the pop the um the test light and the LED test light so that's in another video but this is just for wiring cool. alright first of all you gotta connect your positive. So you can cut it, connect, you can cut it, you can start it at ground if you want, but it doesn't really matter because the circuit is not gonna be completed until we're finished. So that's the positive. Going down here now. This other end needs to be wired in a switch. Remember we're gonna we're gonna power this on by the use of a switch. Not the, the regular push one but it gets the work done. Tell the switch. So that's what we're gonna use here. So we get one end, we can bend this in like that. And we'll connect one end to one side. So that's how we're gonna work it for now. One end on one side. Remember guys, this is basic. Just wanna show you what's going on. So one end is connected. Then we're gonna get your fuse in the game. Your fuse got to be wired in to protect the circuit. So one end is going to go to your switch. The next end is going to go to your load. So you connect this to your load. To your switch. Your, your, your switch, sorry. Not your load, people. Your switch. Protecting the circuit. Bam. Don't be surprised if this drops off during operation. <laughs> this is just a little slap dash work. <laughs> Moving on. So, the next side is supposed to go to your horn. So I'm going to cut this, strip this in. I'm supposed to see this in the last video I showed you guys. I'm supposed to see in the last video. Put this in here. Sorry about that. Put this in here. Raw copper wire, guys. Raw copper wire. This goes to the next end of the horn. So basically, that's connected. Is it? 
Yeah, that's how we talk in Jamaica, you see me? Yeah, connected. Now, I already have this um, connection here. It's a little connector you can buy. It fits on the arm, very, the arm tabs very well. So I'm gonna plug this on. So, as, sorry about that. As you can see, so, so far, just as I've been showing you before, from positive, going down to your switch, and make sure this is off, guys. Yeah, it's off. So, it's off. Then it continues through your fuse, protecting the circuit. Then it goes all the way to your arm. And then you're gonna have this part that goes to ground. That's how this part goes. So I'm gonna put this part to ground. There. So you get the negative on. So we're complete. It's complete. Look at it, guys. It's complete. Power in to your switch. Then it goes to your fuse onward to your iron. The iron is grounded. Now let's test this. Right. Whoa. <laughs> that was loud. Yeah. So you see? It's basic. Hey, get out of the way. <laughs> so that's it, guys. Basic. So in the next video, I'm going to draw a diagram for this. I hope you guys try it as well. So you guys draw a diagram of this as a practice. I'm going to draw a diagram, and in the next video, we're going to do some diagnostic works on this circuit. Hope you like this video. I hope you give it a thumbs up. And I'll be back with the next video soon, soon, soon. Later, guys.